question number four, we have a tank of volume 0.7 cubic meter contains 2.5 moles of helium gas at 10 degrees Celsius. So if helium behaves like an ideal gas, we have to calculate the average kinetic energy per molecule and the total translational kinetic energy. So uh, volume is given as 0.7 cubic meter. The number of moles is 2.5. And we have the temperature, which is at 10 degree Celsius. So remember, we have to always convert the temperature into Kelvin for chapter 9. Chapter 8 saja yang tidak perlu convert, which is on the thermal expansion. So this becomes 283.15 Kelvin. And we know that the average kinetic energy per molecule is equal to... half f k d okay so this one is oh this one is here lah. this formula is given here and you just have to substitute lah. f a helium gas is a monoatomic gas so f is equal to 3 so half 3 f uh, f is 3 k is uh 1.38 times 10 to the power of negative 23, 283.15. Okay, so just substitute that into your calculator, calculate it, and you'll get 5.86 times 10 to the power of negative 21 joule as the average kinetic energy. Next, we have to determine the total translational kinetic energy. So, uh, I would use E because based on our reference book it should be E lah. E is telling us that it is the total translational kinetic energy which is why I use E here this in okay so this is the formula for total kinetic energy of n molecule okay uh, it can also be written as K total dr but this is uh, based on the standardized notes that is given by the matriculation. Uh, but I use E because this is based on the reference book that the notes is based on. Okay, So just don't get it confused. It's actually the same thing. So E is equal to the N times the translational kinetic energy, which is this one here. This can also be written as KTR lah, kinetic energy, average kinetic energy. Ataupun kamu just boleh directly guna 3 over 2 NKT ataupun 3 over 2 NRT. So again, it depends on what information is available lah. But you should have the, you should be able to get the same uh, value lah kalau kamu guna both formulas it's just that now we only have the number of moles instead of the number of molecules so we are going to use nrt lah so from here bila kamu substitute and calculate that you will get that the total translational kinetic energy is equal to 8.82 times 10 to the power of 3 joules okay so that is for question number Four.